they trying to make themselves a home in my home. I'm like, oh my gosh, they're in my room, they're in my room, they're in my room, they're in my room, they're in my room. What it do, YouTube? It's your pretty brown skin girl, Zaria, and I am back with another video. Welcome if you are new here and welcome back if you are not. As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And send this video to your family and friends. How y'all doing? As always, my social media will be drop down below. So, as you can see by the title, I will be doing a story time. This is my first story time, guys. I really don't have a lot of stories to tell, but this is a story to tell. So, as you can see by the title, this story is about a family of squirrels living in my room. Like, we're just about to get into this video. I do have pictures and videos, so I will put them into this video so you guys can see. But without further ado, let's just get into this video. So, I don't even know where to start, but we're going to start one day. I heard, so my bed is right by the window. So the window is right here. And my bed is right here, as y'all can see. So it is very close. So one day I heard something at my window. I didn't know what it was. I look and it's the freaking squirrel. And what is the squirrel doing? He's freaking biting on my window, chewing my window up. It just looking at me, watching him. And I'm not thinking nothing about it. I'm not thinking he trying to dig his way into my room like he did. Anyways, the squirrel is just sitting here tearing my window apart. I'm going to insert a picture. Anyways, the squirrel starts to chew the middle part up from my window and then under the middle part I guess it was some wood and then the little M effort started to chew through it well actually it was a female let me say that I think it was uh, two squirrels it was definitely a family of squirrels oh that was it was I heard scratching so I'm like what the heck I heard scratching I go to my window next thing you know they scratching the wood up the window and I'm up here hitting the window, tapping the window, trying to make them move away. But then I come back minutes later. I was very much terrified at this point, okay? So yeah, I call my dad and I let him know. So he's very much aware that these squares trying to come in. So he come over and look. And I didn't know how to keep them away. So I started to look up stuff on the internet. They said like a mint smell. So I put peppermint smell right there. The voice was still coming back. I don't know. Okay, so finally after all that digging them, the squirrels did, they finally made their way in. This is where it gets, oh my gosh. So... After they make their way in, now I can hear them through my wall. And my wall is right here, as y'all can see. And my bed is right here. So that is very close. So now I'm hearing them in my wall and I'm freaking out. I'm like, Back the fuck up! Move the fuck back! Because I know I don't got no squirrels living in my wall now. The whole time I got squirrels living in my wall. So one day I was just sitting here about to make a YouTube video. Oh my god. I look behind my dresser, y'all. Okay, so before I take all that, the squirrels, I seen them walking past my window with leaves in their mouths. Me not knowing what the, they're trying to do, but still knowing. I'm like, why these boys got leaves? 
whole time. They're trying to make themselves a home in my home. I'm like, no. They just invade my privacy. So I'm still I'm hitting on the window, banging the window, trying to get them to move and get on. But they not leaving. So fast forward, I come sit down to make a YouTube video. I look behind my dresser because my dresser is right here and my wall is right here. But I could still see behind my dresser because I have windows behind my dresser. So it's a little space. So I look behind my dresser and I see a hole. And inside the hole, I see plenty of leaves. So I'm like, oh my gosh, they're in my room, they're in my room, they're in my room, they're in my room, they're in my room. And I'm just freaking out. So I scream, run downstairs. I tell my mama, like, they're in my room. they definitely in my room. I don't know. I just couldn't sleep at night, y'all. <laughs> I just kept thinking about a squirrel coming out that home, trying to attack me in my sleep. You know? So after I seen the hole the hole started to get bigger the freaking squirrel kept chewing her way i guess trying to make a bigger home the whole time you coming in my room sis i, I don't like that you trying to come to my room before i lay my head okay not even five feet away baby pause so as the hole getting bigger i call my dad i'm like yeah these squirrels in my room gotta go well, whole time, I'm still thinking it's just one squirrel, maybe two. I don't know if it was just that one or both of them was plopped. But anyways, I called my dad. He called somebody to come do whatever he got to do. Yeah, the man had put some, I don't know what, I don't know how to explain it, but I got pictures. So the hole wasn't closed, but it was to a point where if he tried to bite someone, he couldn't get in. The picture will explain better than I can. And after that, that still didn't work because later on, they moved to the other side of my window. I couldn't, I just couldn't get enough. So now they scratching into the other side, trying to get into my room again. They in my wall, trying to get to the other side of the wall. I'm just like, this is, no, this can't stop today tonight. So. Every day I'm just calling my dad. He getting irritated with me at this point. So he just come over here one day. Well, after the last time I called him and he called somebody. So he called somebody to come out here and they did what he did. Then my dad came. Then I think my dad had come again. And then the last time is when my dad got the squirrels. So, oh my gosh. So now that the squirrels are trying to make another hole inside my wall in my window, my dad come over and he got right to work. When I say right to work, I mean right to work. He moved my dresser back and then he had made some pneumonia to pour down the hole in my window that leads into the wall because that's where the squirrels was at. So this is where it gets, oh my gosh. So when my dad pulled the pneumonia down the hole, all you hear is squeaking, 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 loud squeaking. I'm just like, oh my God, what is going on? And then whole time the mother, okay, so y'all, it was a mother and three baby squirrels inside my room. What the fuck? A mother and three baby squirrels. I'm always that. They wasn't in my room, but they were in my wall. They were like an inch away from my room, maybe two. But yeah, when my dad poured the pneumonia down the hole, I heard the baby squirrel squeaking. So I'm just like, oh my God, what's going on? I'm thinking the mother gonna come back. She peeked a little bit, but she got the fuck on. She got the fuck on. <laughs> she definitely got on. She did not stay for long because she couldn't do anything. The pneumonia spell was too strong for her, so she couldn't, she couldn't do anything. So as the little squirrel squeaking, my dad knocked some of the wall down so it made it bigger. And he started pulling the baby squirrels out. Y'all, it was three baby squirrels. It was three. But first, when he started pulling them out, he only pulled two out. We were seeing two. And then he got to putting the wood on the wall so he could close it up. And then he heard more squeaking. So he had to unscrew everything he done did and take it apart so he could take that of the squirrel out 
so it was grown ass baby squirrel and they were so tiny they were newborn they just looked this so nasty and i got pictures for it so i'm gonna show y'all everything i got pictures of everything but yeah after my dad came out and did what he had to do another man he closed the wall up and he closed the window up he didn't close the window shut he he caused the thing that they were chewing up but yeah the window said is that what it is i don't know um y'all got pictures so y'all go see but yeah he closed that part up and he closed the wall up <laughs> and ever since then the squirrels have not been back and i am happy and blessed that they have not been back I'm going to need you to dump it. All right, scary cow. I'm going to put it with your sisters and brothers. Zarya all the way back there, y'all. Because I would be losing my mind. But anyways, that is it for this video. If you enjoyed watching this video as much as I love making it for you, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn on the post notifications so you can be notified every time I post. Peace.